up you guys? It's Katya Books. Welcome back to the channel if you are new here. Welcome. Hi. I'm Katya, as I just said. Um, so subscribe. Yeah. <laughs> but anyways, sorry I look disheveled. I just got back from the gym and of course it is time to replenish my muscles with some good food and protein, of course. And that is why we're doing a protein review. Now luckily, I have been able to finally try this protein. I've been wanting to and I just haven't purchased it and then it was on sale and I was like, yes. So they are the Vibrant Health Pro Matcha. So it's got protein and matcha tea, chocolate and vanilla. And I love matcha tea, so I'm wondering if you're gonna taste matcha in it? I don't know. We'll find out. But anyways, so we got vanilla cream and chocolate creme. It's got an accent, so it's gotta be like creme. You know, that's totally how you say it, I don't know. But yeah, just a pre-workout or post-workout. Um, but this one has 21 grams of protein. This one says 22 grams of protein. Excuse me, I got each of my nose. All good. Anyways, so I'm gonna quickly read. It just says, okay, also on it. Antioxidants, natural lift, plant-based, enhanced metabolism, curbs hunger. And if you look at the back, it's got not only like all your vitamins, but it's got all this other good stuff in it so yeah it looks really good and like the only other ingredients like natural and even tells you how much like xanthan gum is in it that is crazy I've never seen that or like whatever organic sugarcane juice powder like whoa that's crazy I've never seen that that is cool I don't know sorry I'm freaking out here but anyways I'm gonna read the macros on the chocolates and we're gonna try both of them because Luckily, the serving is two scoops, so I'm gonna just do one scoop of each so I can try them all right now. But anyways, calories on the chocolate, 140 calories. Now this is for the two scoop serving. Uh, we got 2.6 fat. Gotta be exact with those, you know, decimal points. Carbohydrates, eight. And 22 grams of protein. To bear damn muscles. Yeah, oh my gosh, holy crap, dude. Y'all gonna have to check out my next workout video coming out. It's gonna blow your mind. So subscribe. But anyways, and then the vanilla, we've got 130 calories, two grams of fat, eight grams of carbs, and where is the protein? 21 grams of protein. Okay, so I'm gonna pop these open and we are going to try them out. Yeah, I don't know what that was. Okay, so it was kind of funny actually measuring these out because so I was measuring out half a scoop on my scale, but one scoop for the vanilla, 35.03 grams. You gotta count for that, 0 0.03. And for the chocolate, 38.94 grams. I'm like, okay, well, I can't go into micrograms on my scale, so I just like, cut those in half, but whatever. Um, as you can see, it's like, this is the chocolate, and it has this like, if you could really look, like maybe in the light, it's got this like tint of green, but look at the vanilla. Oh yeah. It looks definitely, cause I think it actually, does it have spirulina? It has chlorella, which gives enough green color. Oh, it does have spirulina, so okay, that definitely is giving the green color. Smells interesting. This smells chocolatey, but this one is like, mm. So let's give it a taste test. Okay, you can taste the matcha, which I actually like because I was kind of hoping for the matcha taste. Um, as for vanilla, it's more like a matcha with a slight sweetness and like a kind of taste of plant protein. Like if you ever have just, cause I think it has just like, yeah, it has pea protein, so you can kind of taste the pea protein, to be honest. I mean, that's, I don't mind because the only other green is natural vanilla cream flavor, and it literally even says 1.5 grams. So they're keeping it all natural here, which is dope AF. So, I mean, that's awesome. And I'm not saying it tastes bad, but I'm just saying, if you're gonna go and buy this, be warned that alone with water, it's just like, it's not like, oh my gosh, this tastes like vanilla ice cream. Like, girlfriend, go buy it right now. I don't know why I just talked like that. 
whatever. But anyways, um, so I'm just like, I'm obsessed with like what's in it. Clean, sustainable, gluten-free, vegan, and non-GMO. Oh, and it even says the caffeine content because matcha has caffeine. This one has 20 milligrams per serving. This one also has 20 milligrams. But yes, vanilla is good. I kind of like the matcha taste. I'm gonna enjoy this protein, but definitely I'll probably mix it with berries and stuff and just put it in a smoothie um, or my oatmeal. I don't know, we'll figure that out. But moving on to the chocolate, the green chocolate. It smells like chocolate, like really chocolatey. Mm. Tastes very much like natural chocolate, let's just say that. Like, it smells more like chocolate than tastes like chocolate. It, it's they probably use cocoa powder. Well, yeah, not yeah. They got cocoa powder, certified organic, whatever, in there, and so it tastes raw. So it's not like crazy sweetened. So again, I love it. Like you don't see if there's any like any crazy sweeteners or whatever in it. So it's all natural and everything. So that's dope, and it's not a bad flavor. I might be crazy because like I always add spirulina into my smoothies and eat a lot of like plain vegetables, so I'm used to that taste. So be warned for those who are like, oh, I'm not crazy about the taste of like vegetables in my smoothie. This, you know, then maybe no, I don't know. But I like it. I totally like recommend it. I mean, will I buy it again unless it's on sale? Yeah. Otherwise, no, because to be honest, to get the full 22 or 21 grams of protein, you gotta do two scoops and then it's 15 servings. I was lucky that it was on sale for like $17, otherwise it's usually like double that price. And for 15 servings, it's not worth it because that's like $2 a serving. I could buy like a sample packet for that much, not less. So, unless it's on sale, go ahead and grab it. Feel free. I mean, otherwise, go check out my other protein review videos and like see what you might like from what I've said about other ones. Otherwise, my favorite supplements are always down in the description box below. Um, so you can always check those out. And I, it's always updated if I find something new and I love something new. But so it's, yeah, it's pretty up to date. And just check that out if you really want to. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this review. To conclude it, I do enjoy them. I just warn you that they are not exactly like vanilla, chocolate flavor if you like we're eyeballing them. Um, but they definitely taste healthy. And who doesn't like to keep themselves healthy? So to each their own when it comes to choosing this. But otherwise, if you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more, excuse me, of these videos, um, yeah, click that subscribe button. If there's anything I haven't reviewed yet, comment it below and I'll try to get my hands on it. Just remember I am vegan, so if it's a protein powder, make sure it's vegan protein powder. Otherwise, pre-workouts and usually other stuff, I am willing to try anything science related of supplement you want me to talk about. I do have a testosterone booster video coming out soon, so stay tuned for that. Subscribe if you're really interested in testosterone boosters and learning about what works, what doesn't, all that cool stuff. So, yes, yeah, stay strong, you guys. Go lift and make those gains. Love you all. Bye.